Hey guys, so this is going to be a duct tape bifold wallet time lapse. So I just decided to film one. Um, me, Creative Arts Carla, and KZ Wallets decided to do a race on a wallet. So, and I think we all three filmed a time lapse, so you should check out their um, time lapses. Their links will be in the description box below. But, so, we didn't time it, we just raced, and I won, but then Creative Arts Carla was close behind, and then KZ Waltz was, you know. <laughs> so, anyway, this wallet is the watercolor chevron with the blue glitter card pockets, and it has pastel pink trimming. So, I clear taped both sides of the card pockets for the blue glitter, because it makes it shiny on both sides, plus I don't like the feel of it. Then that white strip I made was the card pocket behind the ID, and then I just covered it with the blue glitter at the end. So I'm just trimming the card pockets here in pastel pink. I cut the tape down the center because it was kind of a rough edge, and I wanted it to be very nice and not rough. So there I trimmed the ID and the side for the card pocket to be on. So now I'm just attaching the card pocket to it and then cutting the pieces to where they will stick onto the wallet or attach. And I'm moving his quit two times while I'm recording this voiceover, so it's really annoying. And then it doesn't save anything, of course. So yeah, just putting the blue glitter behind it so it matches the rest and then clear taped it. And while I stuck those on, I forgot to clear tape the trims, so I decided to pull them off, obviously, because clear taping the trims makes a big difference in the wallet. So I just did that and then put them back on. So just clear tape the ID. Now placing them back on. And they I placed them down too low so I had to redo them. And then I just lined the other side up with the ones, just making sure the ID fit. Now I'm going to cover the sticky in the card pockets, of course. So even though I don't do like the normal method, I take the clear tape to where it overlaps the piece of tape. Basically, just it doesn't get caught the way I do it, so yeah. That's all that matters. And just clear taping the top piece, and then I will clear tape the rest of the ID later. And to be honest, I really don't think clear taping the ID matters too much, but other people do it, so why not? Um, just, uh, closing up the sides. I couldn't think of what I was doing. And then I think after I close up this side, I clear tape the ID. Well, I cut that off first. And I couldn't find my other X-Acto knife. So, yeah, it was kind of messy at first. And now I'm clear taping the ID seam. Same. Um, now making the outer billfold, and I think I do this different than other people, but I like the way I do it, and it turns out nice, in my opinion. So now I'm just laying the outer tape on top of it, and I did mess up here. I was trying to line it up, and I had to do the tape the opposite way, and I did get it to line up in the end, as you'll see in the clip, but it accidentally stuck, and I didn't want to place it down, so that happened, and I put it on my scrap ball. But then, this time, I got it to work, so... It lined up really nicely, and it only wastes a little bit of tape if I hadn't have wasted the whole 10 inch strip or 9 inch, whatever. Uh, yeah, so now I'm just sealing up these sides and trimming them down. Oh, well, first off, I'm clear taping the buffalo again with the thinner clear tape so that way it doesn't make it thicker. And now trimming it down on the sides and cutting the card pocket slits, and I'm done. Just watched me make this bifold wallet. The seam is clear taped. I actually did that after the time lapse. Um, so it's all watercolor chevron lined up. I kind of messed up lining it up if you saw at the very end, but anyway, it has a white billfold with no sticky and it's clear taped at the bottom. And then here you just have five card pockets. I haven't gotten all the air bubbles out yet because I just like finished it five minutes ago. But so there's the blue glitter card pockets and they're all clear taped because I just don't like the feel of the glitter, even though it doesn't flake off. But then you just add the pastel pink trim, the five card pockets, and they slide in really nice because, I don't know, I use clear tape on the back. So it just slides in really nice. And since I use clear tape on the back, 
they're like blue glittery too. So yeah, that's really cool. And then there's the ID. And Carla's trying to ruin my video, but I'm not getting text while I'm filming, so bye, hater. Anyway, it has the ID, and it's clear taped all around it. And yes, I really like this wallet. So thank you guys for watching, and bye. Oh, wait, I missed the camera. Bye. bye. Subscribe to their channels. Their links will be in the description box.